Well, hello there. In this video, I am going to show you how to edit story quests in Frosty Editor for PVZ GW2. First, open the Levels folder, then open Level FE Hub, and click on Prefabs. Now scroll down and find the spatial prefab blueprint of the quest you wish to edit. For this tutorial, I'm going to be editing the Grumpy Stumpy quest. Open up the objects, and I'm going to open object number one. This is Grumpy Stumpy's character spawn data file. To change his character blueprint, I'm going to go up to the gameplay folder, open soldiers, single click human, then scroll up until I find MP plant torchwood playable, and then I'll assign it to the blueprint. Next, I'm going to edit Grumpy's AI template. I'm going to click these three dots here and select Open Asset. I'm going to change his display name to Thanos Tree. The next thing we'll do is open the customized character data at the top, then open the visual groups and we should find the Boff Torchwood Visual Unlock Asset. To replace this, I'm going to go up to the Characters folder, open Plants, Playable, then Torchwood, and I'll single click Body, and I'm going to find the Torchwood Body Alien Mech Unlock Asset, and assign it there. We can also edit Mission Dialog. To do this, find the Dialog Tree Entity data, which for me is item number 4. So open one of the Dialog Tree data items, and replace the dialog string with your own custom text. Finally, we need to edit Grumpy's display name that appears above his dialog. To do this, open the interface, then open the fields, open the one item in it, and change the string inside the value to your own custom text. I'm going to make it Thanos tree. Okay, we finished editing the quest. Now let's change its name. You will need to go down to the online folder and single click persistence, then open PVZ awards. Now open filtered awards and find the item which has the data for the quest you are editing. For me, it is item number 1115. So just replace the string in the title with your own custom text. You can edit the description too, but we are not going to do that today. Alright, I'm going to save our project real quick. And now, we are going to try out our modded story quest. There he is, Thanos Tree.
Well, that concludes this tutorial. If you enjoy content like this, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and ring the bell. Goodbye.